Hello, I'm Shaw. And I'm Pixel. Thank you to Rhino Games, I Rhino think. Stu. Uh, that's more clever. Yeah. And, uh, this is, uh, David Lynch teaches typing. And okay, I know I have the same model of computer, but where's the any key? Turn the volume down, so hopefully we won't be too uh, drowned out by sound. Honestly, we can say that David Lynch is the guest host. Thank you for joining us, Dave Lynch. No, we'll, we'll be talking later. <laughs> but uh, surprise, surprise, it's you who's playing. I suck at typing, so yeah, enjoy. don't worry about it. Yeah, enjoy so. the enjoy the pain of of my computer jokes that I hope won't get, be lost to my mind. Hello, this is filmmaker David Lynch. I'm going to be taking you to the magical world of typing. By the time you finish this computer program, you'll be a typing wizard. Let's rock. Just gonna enjoy some Philly cheesesteak Pringles while you begin, rest your fingers typing. on the home row with your left index finger on the F key and your right index finger on the J key. Uh, did you have you noticed the brand, Using the computer your brand? Mm -hmm. Index finger, push down on Malcontent. the F key. Oh, it's a uh, Malaklin. Wow, the Kyle Malaklin. Yeah. Well done. Let's move on to the next key. All right, kiddo. Using your right index finger, push down on the J key. Wow! Amazing! Beautiful! We're doing beautiful work here! That was just great! Let's it was, move uh, on! This voice is amazing. And now, place your left ring finger okay. in the undulating bug next to your keyboard. Yeah, that's the problem of uh, buying second hair typing tutorials, so they just don't come with everything they originally did. Place your left ring finger in the undulating bug. So it's a sad looking bug, don't you think? It appears that there has been a glitch in the software. We will have to move on. Okay. We are now going to assess your speed. Are you ready? Not really, but let's see what you have to offer. It's uh, very easy. Great yeah. work, kiddo. How about you reward yourself with a coffee and a smoke? I don't smoke, but I can have this Vichy Ramud. Yes. Cheers. Anyway, I thought this uh, music played for a while. Do, 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 this is what Welcome back to another episode of Low Fi Beats to Relax and Study To. That's what the uh, 
That sounds like the snooze. La last time we left off, no, uh, the stream went offline, and she and she got an A on her assignment. She's working on another assignment for another class. Will she get another A? Let's watch her study and see what happens. A good cup. Uh, I'd say a smoke takes at least seven minutes. Because every cigarette takes seven minutes off your student loans. <laughs> well, if you can't, you know, if you can't pay off your uh, student loans, you might as well take off some time at the end of your life. I think it's more about the conversations that are had during the smoke break than the cigarette itself. Ugh. Dare I continue? Go for it. Okay, using your left pinky finger. Hold down the A key. Now people say that you See why we're pairing it with another game. We uh, literally haven't even met, got to the 10 minute mark. Unless we just ex cut it in two and put some sort of interview with a vampire or something in the middle of it. Like right at the coffee break. Coffee break with. Uh, I don't care what typing tutorial say. I do not use the home key. I hunt and peck like a pro. Yeah, all that uh, time I I did taking uh, typing tutorials and I. Mostly use my thumb for texting and writing. T9 texting was the stuff of fun. Would confuse the hell out of anyone younger than us, though. Uh, I've, uh, I recently kind of discovered that typing can be pretty fun. I was uh, typing and it went like, did a motion where it's like, kind of like locked my hand back and forth. I was like, ooh, look at me go. <laughs> I assume you were 64% more efficient, com Commodore. Got 
about any other computer brands you want to turn into a pun? I don't know if, the, if all of them will appeal. I delve. I don't know, I think these uh, puns may be a little alien to our uh, to our audience. But we're only scratching the surface. Come on, be a pro. Real quick, when play when playing Texas Hold'em, what do the numbers on the cards mean? It means how much how much longer you have left to live. Huh. So four twos and an ace are not good things, huh? Not particularly. Then why did I keep winning? That's all. It was more of a countdown to when your opponent to when the opponents pull out their guns. Hmm. Good to know. At the 12 minute mark, but we're gonna pair this game with something else. Yep. Let's jump straight to it. Welcome back to the exciting game show of Who Just Farted. My name is your host, Pixel Cheesecake, and I'm here with Shala. And I'm a smart fella, smart fella, not a fart smeller. Well, anyway, let's jump into this other game we're pairing with Teach's Typing. This is a virtual open house created by Corpse Pile. Or today will be a. Uh, uh, Pretending to be a couple looking for a new house. I call the wife. Hmm. Fine, be the house spouse. Yeah. Uh. So, so the, uh, As uh, with all wives with, in open houses, he's the one at the wheel. Just a lot of the, uh, the Tumblr posts I saw about someone uh, saying that... Wait, house uh, rhymes with spouse? Yeah. I'm Russian, and that has never made sense to me. Hoose boos. Now uh, we're gonna jump into this. Hello there, my name is Ancient Name. And I'm one of your local North Tree real estate agents for the client neighborhood area. Nice to meet you. Thank you for being part of our alpha testing program. We're excited about our partnership with Optics Dynamics Labs to help bring you the latest and cutting edge real estate technology through nano drones for photogrammetry, and industry-leading ma leading machine learning. But what does that all mean? Well, client name, I'm glad you asked. For the first time ever, we've made the home buying process more convenient by be bringing the full open house experience to the comforts of your personal digital devices. It's home buying revolutionized for the 21st century. Through a combination of camera drones and thousands of still images, we can now scan and recreate a fully explorable three-dimensional snapshot of any home. For a seller, that means 
no more dealing with the inconvenience of multiple showings. For a buyer, you can now browse our entire portfolio while sitting on your couch. This is why we're recording it on the couch, by the way. Mm-hmm. Hey, you're... We're excited to show you the you are perfect home in your client neighborhood area. It's a fresh listing from one of our newer developments. But before we can get into all that stuff, I'll need to show you some basics of how this all works. Don't worry, it won't take long. I promise. Uh, where we are, it's, it's this kind of point and click. Yeah. Now I think we're ready to get started. I, th I highly suggest that you wear headphones to get the full virtual open house experience. Please keep all hands and feet inside the ride at all times and remember to have fun! <laughs> and do let us know if there's anything we can do to improve our ex <laughs> Your experience, because here at North Tree Real Estate, you client name are our highest priority. I, uh, their name is just one too many letters for a certain thing. <laughs> oh my god. So, take a look around. The entryway has a nice modern look with a spacious vaulted ceiling. There's also a convenient bathroom located just down the hall. How are you liking my uh, my sales pit man's voice? I think I'm doing pretty well. I think you're doing amazing at it. Thank you. So that would be. Here we are. In the kitchen, is the as you can see, it's just sort of confined to the area, so there's just kind of white void out there. But that's not too important. Garage. Let's see. With modern appliances and tons of space, you'll never have to worry about having too many cooks in your kitchen. Uh, let's go back to the bathroom. Uh, Want to look inside? No mirror? Aw. I wanted to see the picture of the drone I, uh, that they used. I, there is a mirror, but it just doesn't have a reflection. Mm. No, it's not modded, modeled in this game. Also, when I was first playing this, I thought this was... Uh, like a, a TV holder, and then realized it was a Tarak. And look, it's blood! <laughs> see? See all the horror? Yep. Oh, now it's gone! Ooh! Scary. Right. This guest bathroom has been recently updated with new fixtures and plumbing, so you can rest assured that your guests have the latest and modern convenience. So, and, uh, recently I was uh, at Thanksgiving uh, dinner, and they had a a bat like a bathroom like this, and. Mm -hmm. Like, it feels like it was half the size of this room. It was quite small. It would. It was probably originally a closet until they realized they could run. The what? The what? Main pipe was right there. So yeah. hey, we can actually put bathroom fixtures in it. Yeah. I. Uh, I'm pretty sure they uh, mostly did that in the past, so that. They could have the servants uh, use it without using the good uh, bathrooms. Yep. 
but the, it was downgraded to guest for in terms of erasing ugly truths of history. Yeah. Back yeah, then he used to do that same thing like Mommy wasn't an alcoholic, she's just sleeping on the floor. She's so sleepy. You know, that type of hunky dory mm. She wants her wine, I give it to her in a baby bottle. Welcome to Spaces, the garage. Home of, uh, Unincriminating evidence. The two garage has plenty of room storage, room for storage, or could be converted into that perfect personal space you've always wanted. And there it goes. Wait a second. Isn't this the house from House Party? I don't think I've played that game. We're playing that game then. Okay. I got a... It's right up your wheelhouse. Is it? Is it filled with anime girls? Okay. Good, good. Got a dining room and a living room. This dining room is the perfect entertaining space with clear sight lines to the backyard and living room as uh, backyard and living room, as well as easy access to the kitchen, where I will be the wife. Now uh, I I heard somewhere that. Uh, Open how open concept like houses tend to fail because the the wife can see her husband not doing shit. Yep. Honestly, that's why a detached garage is best yeah. in terms of that. So then go do his projects there. Yep. So. Just look at all that scenic void out there. This cozy living room receives tons of natural light during the day, and the brick fireplace adds the perfect touch of warmth for the cold winter months. Got a nice little uh, countertop. What's that on the clock? Is that a thing? Nope. You'll, well, no, because I'll get the mouse cursor will get all glitchy. Ah, well. I feel like that could reasonably be a thing. Yeah. There's uh, one thing I forgot to mention. So, uh, I can't quite look down, but, any, wait, there you go. Just look at that. It's Marvel. Yep. As a white woman, I am obsessed with Marvel countertops. Marvel countertops? <laughs> I'm sorry I had to capitalize on... Wait, is that a shovel? Yes. But it is, uh, non-important. But it will be uh, a surprise guest appearance later. That's a surprise tool we can use later. Haha. Uh -huh. My thoughts exactly. Last thing I remember, I was running for the door. <laughs> now we're going up the stairs, but he, uh, 
He doesn't have anything to say about stairs. I don't think the salesman trusts stairs. I think they're always up to something. At the very least, they're down to do something. Yeah. And as you can see, they're, I'd say they're perfect for uh, crab walking up and down. Now, this uh, area has a, a potted plant, but I was thinking we could uh, put our anime figures there. Sounds good. I have 3D printer so I can make one life-size. Just, just let me know which one you choose. Gotta uh, put it there like a, the goddess statue. In the Joe Star household. Mm hmm. And if someone tries to break in through the unlocked door. Yep, this is the house from House Party. Uh. Let us know if we should. We should have Shallow play this game. So, a nice, uh. Spacious master bedroom. A massive walk in closet and an in suite bathroom. Make this 500 square feet master bedroom your sanctuary from the hustle and bustle of everyday life. I am nailing these, these blurbs, these blurbs by the way. I like that last sentence. Of course, more marble countertops. Uh, that is a small hamper. We're a big trash bin. Can't tell. I mean... Uh, but yeah, this is definitely the house from House Party. Uh, I'm going to need to uh, upgrade our shower head, the shower head when we move it. There's an RGB one that makes it all rainbow mm -hmm. from at five below. Yeah. We'll stop there for that. And the joke toilet paper from that's filled with the replies of Donald Trump's tweets. Wipe your behind with bad opinions. Uh, why are the massage heading settings on this uh, shower head? No, I, I need uh, a lot of pulse action. I'll pick one up. For, I've been meaning to anyway. As a, as the woman of the household, I spend a lot of time with the vibrating objects of the household. Why is a man, when I go grocery shopping, I avoid the phallic fruits and vegetables? Yeah, there's a, also a, whatever this thing is. Clumps of hair. Uh, it seems veggie Like some kind of root. No, that's the hair. If it's ripped off someone's head. Ah. You can see the blood con connecting the hair to the skin. Ah. So, uh, Goodbye, hair veg thing. So we had uh, three of the four things, and I'm gonna 
I'm going to let you try to see if you can find the fourth thing. I'm going to keep control. This second floor bedroom is perfect for a smaller child or a home, or a home office for when you really need to get work done. I think this would be a good room to record things in. YouTuber office. Yep. Hi, my name's Boxy. I anyone, re anyone remember Boxy? Uh, no. Uh, Twelve painting pictures of the same tree. It's postmodern. Another completely redone and modern but full bathroom means never having to fight over who gets to use the shower first. Awesome! Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Looks like there's a big yard though, perfect for the kids. Yeah. Wait a second. Go back. Uh, in a second. A second floor laundry room means no more hauling heavy loads of clothes up and down the stairs. Talk about real time saving. But what about the dish rags and such? Uh, they didn't. Are those two? Are those loads too light? Yeah. I guess they didn't think of that. You know, I just sometimes I just uh, put a big load in and uh, set it to heavy. Giggity. Mm -hmm. So, uh, hey, look, it's me. I'm watching and waiting. I think I know what what that is though. Wait, it's not. No. Weird. Unfortunately for us, the guys uh, in the closet in the closet is uh, not all right. Not anything we can click on. Or is that just the guy controlling the drone? You got some uh, a. Bunk bed desk thing going on here. Yeah, it saves so much full place for our activities. This end hall room is a large is large enough for two small children or that moody teenager who enjoys their privacy and loud music. Don't get a nuke anyone from orbit there. Yeah. Yeah, Got this desk down here so he can uh, play Genson and uh, drain our savings account. If our kid winds up playing Genshin Impact, I'm sending them to military school. I'd say uh, Genshin is better than Fortnite. Now, okay. Pop quiz. Did you see the fourth thing? I have not, I don't think. You have seen it, you just didn't notice it. Is it the thing on... Underneath the TV? Nope. No, that's, that's probably just a air set thing. Air refresher, you know, those uh, kinds that uh, pop off when you go by. Hmm.
something tells me it's in the not in the laundry room, but in the moody bath, moody teenagers room. Yeah. Uh, Is it the guitar? Nope. Nothing suspicious here, and definitely nothing about this friendly owl. Hmm. Mom, I'm confused. So this video is already almost double the length of the first part, so I'm just going to go to it. Did you pick these scratches? Oh, I didn't even see those. Neither did I. Fucking watering up here for like 20 minutes. So, uh, yeah. Ooh, that's a spooky sound. Yep. So, uh, uh. Well, we already looked at it, so it's too late for that. So, uh, go for the Last front door. Thing I remember I was running for the door. Gonna slide on over. You installed the VPN so they didn't know where we lived, right? Uh, the current scan has encountered a memory error, recompiling data from an earlier restore point. Available full scan today, approximately one hour ago. Well, uh, that's waiting for NordVPN to uh, sponsor us. Dang it. Well, I 3D printed a couple knives. We should be... Oh. Yep. It's a... Uh, Blood Bank Central up in this bitch. And I'd, uh, I'd go somewhere else, but, uh... It's a little linear down here. One hour ago. <laughs> Got uh, two bodies. And the and the third. Uh, this guy. Howdy. That's my favorite uh, jump scare. Ground beef. So, uh, one adult, one child. Let's be inclusive and say it's a husband. A single father in Hollywood. What are the odds? So. Remember, in Hollywood, you either get spiritual or get corrupted. Yeah. Uh, things may be bloody, at least uh, we still have the house plant. Be scanning the rooms. Just kind of going in there for a bit. It's just a reflection of the light. Because uh, this part's a live feed. So. Yeah. Then. 
Yeah, I think we just got this one. No, I'm pretty sure we got the other one. Oh boy. What a time to play this game. Yeah. So, this was this I'm, was purposeful, wasn't it? I uh, I'm pretty sure it's sent to our computer clock because I could not have a uh, I would not have remembered to uh, time it so purposely. Sure. Trying to scare me. <laughs> Not gonna work. I'm up to chapter three in Bendy and the Dark Revival, so yeah. I'm good. Wait a sec. So the only other room is this one, the master bedroom, when it uh, decides to open up. Let me. In the, the the unless it's trying to get to the us to go to the other room because I think you were just in the bathroom so oh. Saving and compiling? Yeah. Um. Ah. This is one. Can I have it? Yes. Thank you. Yeah, we can uh, sometimes open doors. What the squiggly snake turning in a circle bullshit? Yep. Yeah. We're diving deep down into some impossible space. Wait. Uh, Highly saturated. Couple. You point out where you see a couple. One person, the other person. Yeah, I just don't know what this is at all. I was. Game Theory, get on this. We put you on to Amanda the Adventurer. I posted about us playing it on Twitter before he ever got his hand, hands on the learning desire to learn about the deep lore. Anyway, uh, moving on from that one, we'll just uh, there's that make around and find uh, more of them. One, two, three, four, one, two, eight. There are now eight of them, all as uh, ambiguous as the rest of them. And watch it cover the wall. So uh, I thought it was going to be fully tiled, but okay. Yeah. So, uh, I really prefer uh, some tiles in my impossible space. There's a VR experience for you. You're a non-Newtonian fluid. Mm -hmm. In a non-Euclidean world, a blob 
trying to survive from a, gr a group of adventurers. The wizard has low health, but he can cast magic, so he has range and lingering effects. Mm. The fighter has a lot of health, but he's slow, but hits hard. The archer has range, but has low health. As long as they didn't bring their uh, uh, bags of rock salt, we should be good. Anyway, I think I... Uh... So we have to go the other way to get out of the impossible hallway, or...? Hey look, it's him again. Don't run away from me, you little bitch. You gotta show us the rest of this house. Spawn It character from the hit uh, novel uh, It by Stephen King. Yep. The clearly, the clearly not homophobic clown, or something. Uh. Wait a sec. Were uh. we just there? Here. Yeah, uh, there's not much going on with this side of it, so we're just gonna go, down go back. Uh, have you ever uh, read it? Yep. So I... Then I don't have to inform you. Oh no, footsteps. I'm just keeping you in footsteps, baby, in the dark, Ooh, in the dark. Ooh. Ready or not, here I come, you can't hide. I'm gonna find you and eat you slowly. Ready or not, here I come, you can't hide. I'm gonna find you. Just like little Georgie. Red, red, rumen, red, 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 rumen, red, red, rumen, red, 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 rumen. I'm a fan of verbal lace. Yes. You can probably tell though. Alright, uh, I was thinking that the uh, eat you slowly still works. Yep. And we're going to uh, change cameras to the. Uh, Infinite, uh, spaghetti ground beef dimension. It's a ground beef, uh, we already had the ground beef scare. Now, the good thing about the infinite, uh, ground beef dimension is that you can have infinite, uh, nacho meat. You just have to find your, uh, the infinite tortilla chip dimension. Not one way to end world hunger. Yes. Uh, tacos for everybody. Mm hmm. Ooh, fun idea. Mm hmm. Give Mario an axe and put him in Castlevania. It's a 2D game, but with 3D locations. Mm. What's this weird tear thing? Looks like part of a different dimension. You go through it, you're all Lords of Shadow. The Mario jumps from 2D to 3D in, in terms of Castlevania. Mm -hmm. But giving Mario an axe would probably be like too overpowered for him. Yeah. Wait, don't you have to go up the stairs and press tab again, basically? Yes, but, uh... I'm just gonna back, walk, uh, moonwalk for a bit. See how far back it goes? Yes. Uh, this far, apparently. 
We're just going to be a, a bit of a tease. Sounds good. Uh, what do you like on your tacos? I'm more of a just plain meat and cheese guy. Maybe some lettuce, to, depending on how healthy I can... But Fiesta Blend for, for sure, cheese-wise. Either that or the three cheese blend. Yeah, you're, you're definitely going to need uh, all the vegetables you can get when you're having it with a Dorito shell. But that, but, but that's the only way everything balances out. It's, uh, it's like a, there's a commercials where it's a part of a balanced breakfast. <laughs> And then, uh, hey look, it's the, uh, interface. Well, what do you think? Do you think this is the house of our dreams? I certainly think so. Or at least the house of our nightmares. One or the other. Yeah. Yeah. The corpse pile on Twitter? Yep. Yeah, that's accurate right now. I haven't even touched Twitter in a while. I only go there for the, uh, well, memes. We'll just leave it at memes. Yes. Minus eight enthusiast. Yeah. Big, uh, Voluptuous memes. You see Chunky Moon and Minus 8 full of vinegar in terms of keeping fans and their creations going. Yeah. Ooh, the offer has been accepted. Expect the call soon. Yeah. We might show the move-in. Yeah. Uh, hey look, it's us. We're flying! Jumping for joy. Yep. Uh, and this has been... Untitled House Game? I mean, no. The Open House. The Open House. Here. It's an open house, and you are a terrible goose. Honk. Oh. Honk to steal all the all the commemorative state spoons. Honk. Anyway, we're gonna uh, move on and, and uh, to our next game, but we'll see you next time. I've been Pixel. And I'm Shaw. And we will see all of you in whatever we record next. Laters. Peace.